Let's skip the intro and make this video short and concise. First, let's get the spiral tool. With this tool selected, we can click and drag anywhere on our canvas. And while still holding down the mouse button, we can press the control key or the command key on Mac and here we can set the decay of the spiral. It looks like this. Decay basically means how parallel you want the lines to be. Also, we can click the up and down arrow key to add segments to the spiral. This will make the spiral longer or shorter. If you want to reverse the direction of the spiral, you can simply click the R key. And the last hotkey you can use is Shift that enables you to rotate the spiral in 45 degree increments. When you're happy with the spiral, you can simply release the mouse button. And from here, the spiral simply behaves like a stroke, which means that you can go to the stroke menu and make the stroke wider, make the line dashed if you want, or even add arrow hits. You can also add width profiles like this, or even add a brush to the spiral. <laughs>